Amber Heard has been accused of hurling various injustices toward her former husband Johnny Depp, one of which is also her constant infidelity. Amber has had her fair share of ups and downs in the romance department. Aside from her star ex-husband, with whom she's currently engaged in a nasty courtroom battle, the actress has navigated relationships with many high-profile figures, ranging from billionaire Elon Musk to cinematographer Bianca Buddy. But just how many people did Amber see on the side while still with Depp? Let's find out. Actress Amber Heard is undoubtedly no stranger to the spotlight. While she got her start in Hollywood with minor roles on shows like The O.C. and made her film debut in Friday Night Lights, her high-profile relationships have been in the headlines just as much as her career triumphs. The Zombieland and Pineapple Express actress came out as bisexual in 2010 and has been linked to several stars since then. Her tumultuous relationship with Depp saw the Pirates of the Caribbean actor accuse her of cheating with several other men and women. Amber's first high-profile relationship was with painter and photographer Tasia Van Rie. The pair dated from 2008 to 2012, and while they were together, Amber came out as bisexual. At Glad's 25th anniversary event in 2010, she said, I don't label myself one way or another. I have had successful relationships with men and now a woman. I love who I love. It's the person that matters. When asked why she decided to officially come out, Amber said she wanted to use her platform and fame to be a good role model. I think when I became aware of my role in the media, I had to ask myself an important question. Am I part of the problem? And I think that when millions and millions of hardworking, tax-paying Americans are denied their rights and denied their equality, you have to ask yourself, what are the factors that are an epidemic problem? And that's what this is. Tasia, who gained notoriety for taking black and white photos of celebrities, eventually called it quits with Amber, but not before getting her name tattooed on her body. It is thanks to Tasia that Amber and Depp met. The pair first met on the set of the 2011 movie The Rum Diary and were later married in 2015. The Justice League actress filed for divorce two years later, but that was just the beginning of what would become a years-long legal saga. Amber obtained a temporary restraining order against her ex in 2016 after alleging he had been physically and verbally abusive during their relationship. After their divorce was finalized, they issued a joint statement saying their relationship was intensely passionate and at times volatile, but always bound by love. Neither party has made false accusations for financial gain. There was never any intent of physical or emotional harm. In 2019, the actor sued Amber for defamation after she wrote an op-ed in the Washington Post about leaving an abusive relationship. The case is currently ongoing. During Amber and Depp's relationship, it was reported that she was having an affair with billionaire Elon Musk. Amber started dating the tech billionaire in 2016, and the pair were on and off for almost a year. They spent a lot of time together while Amber was shooting a movie in Australia amid her messy divorce. In a 2020 court case involving Johnny Depp, text messages sent on May 22, 2016 between Amber and Elon were read out. The message came one day after an alleged domestic violence dispute involving Depp, and Amber told Elon she wanted a restraining order against her ex-husband. In the text, Elon offered her 24-7 security, adding, the offer would stand even if you never wanted to see me again. Anyway, sorry for being an idiot. The radio silence hurts a lot. It only matters because I really like you. Amber was also linked to British model Cara Delevingne in 2016 amid her messy split from Johnny. It was first reported in September that the pair were getting close while Amber was in London shooting a movie. They have been seen at the hotel loads and are always very giggly and thick as thieves out until the early hours, a source reported. They were spotted grabbing a coffee in October and were photographed in December, leaving Rihanna's party together. Nevertheless, the pair never confirmed their rumored romance. Other people the actress saw on the side while still living with Depp are film director Tom Hooper and movie star Eddie Redmayne. Amber Heard returned to the stand and testified that her ex-husband once accused her of having affairs with the Danish girl director Tom Hooper and star Eddie Redmayne. The Aquaman actress, 36, revealed that one of her biggest fights with Depp began over his accusation that she slept with both her co-star and director from The Danish Girl. Amber returned to the sets of The Danish Girl shortly after marrying the black 
Mass actor in 2015. In her testimony, the actress said that she denied having an affair with either Hooper or Redmayne during that time, but said that Depp continued to accuse her about it, eventually calling her hotel room to check she was there. James Franco was another guy Amber dated while still married to Depp. Amber had the Why Him actor over to her home the night before she filed for divorce from Johnny Depp. In her testimony, Amber explained that she was close friends with Franco, whom she made two movies with. She also claimed that Depp would often get jealous and accuse her of having affairs with her co-stars and didn't want her to continue acting. Other people Amber reportedly dated are art dealer Vito Schnabel, film director Andy Muschietti, Telenova star Valiento Lanus, and cinematographer Bianca Buddy. Clearly, Johnny Depp had more than one reason to part ways with the troubled ex-wife, but how their hearing will end is still in the hands of the jury, and we are leaving nothing to chance. In our upcoming video, we'll be bringing you more news, views, and reviews on the final stretch of the case, so be sure to subscribe to our channel so that you don't get to miss any of them.